Are Bible codes credible? A significant number of Christian leaders today hail Bible codes as important evidence for the inspiration of Scripture. While they claim post prophecies such as Israeli Prime Minister Yitzhak Rabin's assassination in, in 1995 are encoded in the biblical text, biblical codes in reality a little more than a fringe variety of Jewish mysticism that's been repackaged for Christian consumption. First, like its older permutation, Bible numerics, Bible codes are, at best, a pseudoscience. Codes are discovered by searching for equidistant letter sequences that can be compiled into intelligible messages pertaining to past events. One can search left to right, right to left, top to bottom, bottom to top, or in a diagonal direction. And although sequencing may vary from word to word, none of the prophecies can be known beforehand. Like Monday morning quarterbacking, hindsight is always perfect. Furthermore, Bible codes are a rigged game complete with after-the-fact prophecies, and self-validating messages. While ELS practitioners contend such historical events as the assassination of Rabin are encoded in the Torah, nothing could be farther from the truth. Because Old Testament Hebrew does not contain vowels, alleged codes such as Rabin bang bang could just as easily refer to Christopher Robbins shooting his pop gun at balloons Winnie the Pooh was holding when he floated over the Hundred Acre Wood. For that matter, the self-validating message could refer to the, the tire blowout that Batman sidekick Robin experienced while riding at the Batmobile. It could even refer to mafia hitmen named... Rabino, who had two successful kills. Bang, bang. Finally, although the message of the autographer, the original text of the Bible, is unquestionably clear in the best available manuscript copies, minor differences in spelling and style make it impossible to validate the supposed divine inspiration of equidistant letter sequencing. Such minor inconsistencies leave the meaning unaltered, but completely undermine all attempts to find equidistant letter sequences. Moreover, the coincidences of equidistant letter sequences that do occur in the Torah are not unique. They occur in every other work of literature from Homer to Hobbes and from Tolkien to Tolstoy. Bible codes shift the focus of biblical apologetics from the essential core of the gospel to esoteric speculations. Those who deny the incontrovertible evidence that Jesus rose from the dead are not likely to be persuaded by the pseudo-apologetic of Bible codes.